Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Z Santa Maria here and Elves. Summer is upon us. And with that, we have to get into summer fragrances. And you all, I figured today was the perfect time to get into possibly considered the ultimate summer fragrance in a bottle, you all. And the ultimate fragrance of summer that I'm talking about is none other than from the house of Tom Ford. And we're talking about Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc, darling. Yes, Soleil Blanc. So yes, we're doing a day dedicated fragrance review on Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc today because uh yeah it's vacation season summer is like knocking at the door and we need to talk about her so yes before we get into it all the way elves you know what we must do first lipstick of the day everyone we went with this peachy nude situation and the lipstick I'm rocking is from MAC it's called Pander Me this was in a limited edition um matte collection they did years ago so it was limited edition but you can probably find something similar to it i'll try to link something that's kind of close to it as well and i also put a little bit of the fenty gloss bomb cream on top this is the shade honey waffles that i have on top to make it pop so that is your lipstick of the day next up fragrance of the day i want to keep it fun and happy today because that's kind of how i'm feeling it's just yes summer and i went with parfums de marley Oriana. Yes, Oriana is such a fun and playful scent. But don't worry, Oriana will get its own dedicated review at another time, not right now. Again, Parfums de Marley, Oriana is the fragrance of the day. So now let's talk about Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc, you all. And we will discuss at the end, is this the ultimate summer fragrance? So let's get into it. First things first about the fragrance, it was released in 2016. So this scent is officially over five years old now. And it has solidified itself as a staple in the house of tom ford's fragrance collection it's one that if you go on instagram and you see you type in hashtag tom ford or at tom ford beauty whatnot you're going to see soleil blanc especially this time of year and and there's a reason for that so again released 2016 the notes in tom ford's soleil blanc are coco de mer cardamom and ylang ylang and it's classified as a solar floral amber fragrance so very interesting we're gonna get into that it comes in four different sizes by the way i'm looking down because i have my notes because i came prepared for you all so we can talk about it, it comes in four different sizes which is very very generous for tom ford because all of his fragrances are not granted that luxury at all and i need them to grant that luxury to some more <laughs> but to get it started the first size that it comes in is the 10 mil size and that retails for $65 and I do have a 10 mil size this is what it looks like with the 10 mil you can take the top off atomizer and you can pull it out and that's what it looks like then we have the 30 mil size which retails for $163 but then we have the 50 mil size that's the most iconic size of them all that one retails for $270 and that is the size I do have as well the 50 mil size right here and I absolutely love this bottle then we have the 100 mil size which is the big daddy and that retails for $365 so yeah, you love you some Soleil Blanc if you got the big bottle. <laughs> so those are the different sizes. Another good thing about Soleil Blanc is that it also has a matching shimmering body oil. Yes, and guess what? Yes, I do have the shimmering body oil as well to discuss because this is also a bottle that is so Instagrammable. I've seen it a lot on social media as well. And yeah. There's a reason for that too. So we're gonna talk about all of this, you all. So those are the stats and the specs on the scent. So now let's get into what you all care about, which is we're gonna get into the rating system. So I'm gonna spray a little bit of the fragrance on my strip, let that dry down while I discuss how this rating system is gonna go down. The rating system, when it comes to fragrances and dedicated reviews, it goes like this. First one is a mood, and that is simply, how does this fragrance make me feel, and where am I wearing this fragrance? Second is strength, and that's on a scale of one to 10, with one being just water in a pretty bottle, to 10 being nuclear. After that, we have longevity. Longevity is how many hours did this scent last, could you just continue to smell it before it faded all the way out to black. And the last category, arguably the most important for most people, and that is, is this a compliment getting fragrance? And that is a yes or a no. We discussed it there. My fragrance is drying down and yeah, let's get started with this rating. You all, we have to acknowledge something. I absolutely love the bottle. The white and gold aesthetic is just everything for summer. And then you also have Tom Ford up top on the label. And I love that. So I definitely like that. I even like too that the atomizer 
but for the travel size, as I like to call it, the atomizer matches the bottle. This is so cute. I did buy this in the uh, Sole Blanc gift set, so that's why I have both of them, which I was so excited to get because the gift sets, as you all know, they come out around the holiday season, and I always talk about Tom Ford gift sets during that time for their reason because you end up getting the travel size for the price of what the bottle costs by itself, so it's just a better value. So that way you got one throwing your purse or throwing your suitcase, so that way you don't have to take your big bottle with you, especially when you're going like on a plane, and you know. That 50 pound weight limit be kind of a struggle sometimes. And then concerning the body oil, I wanna talk about this as well. Look how pretty the bottle is. And you literally see the shimmer dancing around in it. Look how pretty that is. This is so luxe and luxury, so summer. Obsessed. Okay, we had to take that moment to talk about that. <laughs> so now let's get into mood. Where am I wearing this scent after I smell it? Y'all, this scent has definitely a scent memory for me and I'm, I'm gonna get into that. So mood, this is ultimately summer. This is luxurious summer, you all. This does have that sun tanny lotion vibe to it, but it's so creamy. This isn't copper tone. No, it's not, <laughs> I have to say that. Definitely elevated. You definitely get that cardamom in it that gives a little spice to it. And I'm really digging that vibe in here. But oh, this I am wearing to an all white affair party. I'm wearing this to a yacht party. I'm wearing this to, hmm. I'm wearing this to a beach wedding. I'm wearing this there. Just anything that's upscale and it requires a dress code of all white, for sure, I'm definitely wearing this. That's the mood. Now let's talk about strength. Strength, you all, on a scale of one to 10. This is not a powerhouse nuclear scent. Strength, to me, is about a seven. And it's one of those scents that it starts out as a seven, but it truly like meshes with your body chemistry and it does become a skin scent. But because it has that solar sunscreen type of vibe, it just makes it smell like, you just smell like summer, just eternally. You just woke up and automatically smell like summer as it gets older. It's one of those type of things. So yeah, strength, to me, is a seven very nice but it's so creamy it's so creamy and i really enjoy that that's that coco de mer now let's talk about longevity longevity on this scent i get a solid i get a solid five hours on my skin where i can truly smell it five to six on a good day and i will say this too this is a scent that heats up like it works best when it is 100 degrees outside like it is literally right now in my area this is a scent like when i wore this during a cold day just because i wanted to test it out just to see i wore this on a cooler weather day and the longevity did not do anything i got maybe four hours out of it however when you wear it in the sun where it's really truly meant to shine y'all it lasts all night it lasts all day this is literally meant to be a summer scent i just yes <laughs> it's so pretty it's really really luxurious and now for the final category which is compliment getter compliment getting factor is this a compliment getter and you know what you are it absolutely is this is a summertime stunner 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 this is a forever fragrance in my opinion for that reason because if you especially if you wear an outfit where you have a lot of skin showing so say like dresses that don't have straps or they're like cami style dresses for my ladies that like to be flirty i know i personally love cami dresses the more skin you have exposed and this is on your skin the more people are going to get a whiff of you the sillage your bubble people are gonna be like oh my goodness you just smell amazing and that happened every single time i wore this out because again this was my favorite undisputed champ for summer 2021 that's why i will be wearing it a lot again this summer because it got so many compliments in people are like oh my goodness nobody smells like you what are you wearing i literally had to stop what i was doing like i'm like partying on the dance floor when i was like at a backyard lake party situation and i literally like screenshot and showed the girl like hey this is what it is you know because i don't hoard information y'all it's a fragrance you know what i mean if somebody asks me it's like yeah sure i'll tell you because i mean at the end of the day i already have my bottle you see what I mean? So it doesn't hurt to share. It's okay. And I literally was sharing pictures and telling them where to get them. Like, you all, you can get it at Sephora, girl. Like, yeah, you need home for it. So they want because like, I'm on it for my vacation. So absolutely, this is the ultimate summer fragrance for sure. I think there's everything. Oh, 
and the hotter it gets the better it performs absolutely and i also want to again touch on this here luxury shimmering body oil this stuff is so good i'm actually going to spray a little bit on my skin so you all can see it and what i love is is that it has the same and yes the shimmer does come out as you can see very nice it has the same scent as the fragrance so this literally helps to magnify the scent and when i tell you when i pair these together oh they last all day then it's just mm, yes mm, 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 mm. and it's just it's sexy sheen that is everything you all i wore this all up and down on my legs let me tell you scent memory moment I wore this scent a lot when I was in LA and particularly in the daytime and the main memory I have wearing Soleil Blanc as well as the shimmering body oil you are. I wore it to Venice Beach where I totally got my entire life with the locals and I remember just having it on the beach and just inhaling it and so for me I'm just taking that moment all the way in just looking at the water, the ocean, the people, seagulls. <laughs> It was such a moment, but this scent for me, Soleil Blanc, is tied to that memory. I really enjoyed that, and I look forward to making more memories with Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc. I think it is marvelous. I think it is excellent, and it's definitely worth getting your nose on for sure. And one thing I like about this one, this is one of the Tom Ford's that's more readily available because, again, it's not new new. It's been around now, so it's, a, it's more available at a lot more retailers. So you can actually like smell it in a lot of different department stores. You don't have to like only wait to go to say Anemia Markets to smell it. No, this is way more accessible. Like now my Sephora's carry it. So I could go in and smell it if say if I just wanted to at least experience it and test it out on skin, you can do that. So it's much more accessible now than it used to be. And I love that. So yes, ultimately, do I think this is the ultimate summer fragrance? Yes, I do. This was again, last year's Undisputed Champ is the scent of summer. And as we're going into summer 2022, Oh yeah, we're gonna be rocking time for a Sole Blanc for sure. I already have like three events lined up and yeah, I'm definitely gonna end up reaching for it at some point for sure. It's coming. Yeah, it's coming. <laughs> so that is my fragrance review on the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you own this scent? Do you own the shimmering oil? Because I have seen some people only buy the oil because it is fragrant and they get the effect there. That's cool. There's also a lighter version, the oldest Ole Blanc, which is the Toilet version, but y'all know I like parfum, honey. So we had to get the real deal. Yes, yes, but that is an option. And again, to a, it comes in multiple sizes like this, which is really, really cool. I had some on there. <laughs> so we do like that it comes in a lot of different sizes, so it's more accessible for a lot of people. And it is available at a lot of retailers. Let me know what you think about the scent. Do you love it? Do you hate it? Do you already own it? Let me know in the comments below. As always, if you're digging me, subscribe to the channel. If you're digging the content, please hit that like button. And if you're mad at this review and over it, and that's okay. I still appreciate you taking time to watch. Until next time, I will catch y'all in the next video. Bye, else.